Hey guys, welcome to Home Reviews. In this video, we're gonna be talking about a product that everybody should have in their home, and that is a combustible gas leak detector. Now, this is one that is made by a company called, I think it's Topties or maybe Toptis. Uh, but this one here, it detects different types of gases, including things like propane, natural gas, sewage gas, methane, just different types of gases. And it has different sensitivity levels on it as well, which makes it great. So if you have maybe a, a gas grill or maybe even a gas oven in your home and maybe you think it's leaking, this here will be able to pick it up and tell you. And so I'm gonna show you how this works, but uh, it's a really neat little device. It's pretty small. You can see here it came in this box with two Duracell batteries. It actually came with two really good high quality batteries. And all you have to do is just unscrew this bottom part here and you put the batteries in. You can see right there, it shows you which direction the batteries go, which is always nice. But what we're gonna do is I'm gonna test this here on my gas grill to show you how it works now if this is something you're interested in picking up because they are very affordable especially for what they offer uh, i'll put the link below this video and that way you can go check them out there on amazon but what you do is after you put your batteries in you just have to push down the power button for one second and then what's going to, well let me just go ahead and do it for you let me turn it off and we'll power it on and you're going to see it shows those little bars there and it's going to do this for 30 seconds maybe up to a minute and what it's doing is it's calibrating so you want to give it a minute it's going to beep a couple times when it's ready and then you can choose between high and low to check on if you think there's any gas leak so if i come over here to the instructions we'll go ahead and just give that uh, a few more seconds here but but you can see here it talks about the low sensitivity and high sensitivity okay there it is there it's ready uh, it says here that you can start measuring it says here you can start measuring in the high sensitivity mode which is 50 to 500 ppm press the low sensitivity button to enter low sensitivity mode of 500 to 1000 ppm now what does that mean well in low sensitivity mode concentration levels are measured in larger intervals than in high sensitivity mode meaning there needs to be a greater concentration level uh, to illuminate the indicator light or to let you know that there's something there. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna put it on high. If you do that, you're gonna see it says high there. If you wanna switch it to low, you just click it and it switches back and forth, super easy. Uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna test this though. So what I'm gonna do is lift up the lid and you can see right under here is where the flames come up under the grill. So. If I was to stick this right here, they're going to see nothing happens. And that's because there is no propane on. But I'm going to turn this knob and we're just going to turn it to low and we're going to see how long it takes and if this picks it up. So we'll just turn it all the way down to low and we're going to give it a second here and see what happens. And there it goes already within just a matter of a few seconds. You can see it, it is picking that up on low. So I'm going to go ahead and turn that off. Move this out. Give it a few seconds to clear out. And then it's back to normal. Now we could also go ahead and do low. We're going to let that air out just for a minute. Actually, I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll come over here on the other side. And put it right there. And there's nothing. Yeah, see it's still picking up where I had that turned on a minute ago. So it picks up really, really uh, low detections of different types of combustible gas. Now, the, a couple other things I like about this is if you look here, it has a 10 minute auto off. So if you forget and leave it on, it's gonna turn it off. And it also has a low battery indicator. That way, um, you know, obviously you wanna know if your device isn't working the way it should be or if the battery's low because you want it working the best it can if you got a situation where you think your gas is leaking. All right, so I think we're good. Everything's cleared out. Let's flip this thing on. And we'll give it just a second here. And there it goes. So there you go. And you can hear it beeping, so you know it's going off. But this is a really nice little device to have. I'm going to highly recommend that uh, if you have any kind of gas in your home outside of your home natural gas propane that uh, you consider getting something like this and if you look under specifications you can see here 
that it will detect different types of uh, combustible gases such as methane, natural gas, propane, liquefied, petroleum gas, sewer gas, gasoline, and other types. So um, I want to recommend this, guys. If you want to pick it up, that link's below this video. It'll take you to Amazon where you can learn more about this neat little device. But if you enjoy these types of reviews, be sure to subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys in the next video.